Right now, the Predator is extremely valuable. It's the number one demanded asset in the Air Force. There's a lot of eyes on it because of its capabilities and what it has shown the world. It's paving the way for unmanned vehicles. We've taken an aircraft that was expected to be nothing more than a spy drone. We've turned it into a fully capable combat platform. The modem allows the Predator aircraft to communicate via satellite link anywhere around the world. This will track 360 degrees to maintain a direct line of sight with the satellite that the pilot uses to control the aircraft. The flight sensor unit allows the aircraft to sense its own movement through the air. If it's being side slipped because of wind or anything to that, this will sense that and it will counteract that movement. The multispectral targeting system, the MTS ball, is the primary payload of the Predator aircraft. And basically this is our sensors payload and also our target designator for firing the Hellfire missiles, the laser guided weapons. This is what the sensors operator is using whenever he's keeping an eye on the good guys or the bad guys for that matter. This is the uh, AGM-114 missile, the Hellfire missile, originally uh, built for the Apache. Uh, this is a laser guided uh, Hellfire missile. You can see the uh, glass that is uh, on the front. Basically it uh, picks up the laser energy and it guides directly to the laser spot that the sensor operator is putting on the target. It is a combat aircraft, but what I feel the most important role the Predator is, is keeping an eye on the good guys, protecting the good guys. One of my most significant moments overseas is when I have Army personnel come up to me in the aircraft hangar, and they come over and shake my hand, and they say, are you with Predator? And I say, well, yeah. They say, well, I was just out on a combat patrol, and a Predator saved my life. You're directly saving lives by uh, flying this bird over our troops. It's really a good feeling to know that you're helping the guys on the ground, and that's really why I think all of us do it.